welding is a male-dominated world. You don't really see much girls in welding business. But at the Advanced Technology Complex, that world Wiggling sounds like a that, little different. It won't burn because as long as you're still in the electric holder, it's still burning in there. It's getting worse stuck. The welding industry is about 5% female. So um, I, I think of it as like a grassroots effort to infiltrate the ranks, you know. Rebecca Hendricks is the welding teacher at the ATC. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of like a multi-path there. Run one across the top of it. And she's very good. National title caliber good. In fact, her kids have won a couple of national titles. But Hendricks students say her contest wins are not what makes her special. She actually connects with you and asks you how, how your day is going or how's your family or how's the cars or animals and all that. I mean, she actually connects and acts like a real person should be. Miss Hendricks, she's, she tells jokes, she's very fun, but she can also be very, like, she teaches you. She doesn't just all jokes and you can do whatever you want. She treats us like we're adults and that feels good for, for kids like us. They're, we're close to being adults, but it's, it's nice, especially in a classroom environment, because um, like I said, that's how, we, that's how we start to learn and that's how we, that when you become an adult, really it's learning things on your own and that's a, that, re that really helps. That relationship allows Hendricks to get the most out of her students, which is even more amazing because for some of these kids, school really wasn't their thing until the spark started to fly in Hendricks' class. This is a completely different environment. The kid that may have had trouble paying attention in an English classroom um, because he has ADD or may have had struggles with reading because he has dyslexia. Those kids excel in this environment. Those are my people. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I get those kids. I, I, I understand them completely. Um, a lot of them come in here with mechanical abilities that they've never been able to, to be the smartest kid in the room. And then they come in here and they've got three or four solutions to a problem and the other kids are looking at them like, wow, this guy's a rock star. And they've never had that. That kind of feeling stays with a kid. It can even change the direction of their life. And Hendricks loves providing a place where that type of amazing can happen. They've transitioned from a bad student or someone that's not studious into someone that's learning, but they're having fun learning. They're enjoying this. I just always look forward to this class because I get to do something that I like or I love. And I mean, she's always cool about it, super fun. She's the best.